Hi. Or Ohio, as they say. How's it going? How's it going? Okay, move on. Oh, I can't get used to how much smoother this game looks. It's just so weird to me. Let's get him. Oh my I'll care for you. Thanks. Why are they all going my after God. Reen? <laughs> Fuck me, guys. It's just pain. I'll save you. <clears throat> Thank you. It's my turn. Here to play. My turn. Let's go. It's my turn. I'm here. We can kill people. Oh, did we win? Yeah, let me see, uh what Reen's got on, because I'm not sure why everyone in the world is going after him. Yeah, nothing... Weird. Well, in that case, he doesn't need hit one. Give that to someone who will need it more. Why the fuck has Kurt got a mind? What the hell? Holy fuck, she's got Diamond Nova. I'll fucking take that, thanks. Yeah. 
Okay. Charge complete. <laughs> We're at an advantage. Hmm. Thinking about how I want to play. I shall go. Arcus activated. It's my turn. Arcus activate. Ow. More. Oh yeah. Let's go. Got about that. I'm here. Huh? I shall go. I've just activated. It's my turn. Kane Dale. Huh? It's down. Use a cover me. Leave it to me! Oh, that's not what I wanted at all. Can't wait to get my mitts on that chest. Rent seal, okay. Give that to one of the lovely ladies then. Refreshing. Oh, that's uh, only engage that one if necessary. Mm. Mm. We'll get there eventually. Be on guard, it's strong. Terrible idea, but fuck it. There. I'll assist. Engaging. Arcus activate. Go. Yeah. It's my turn. More sorry, I'm just like. It 
It's my turn. It's down. Oh, oh, oh. My turn. I shall go. It's my turn. Now, my turn. Here to play. I shall go. Charging. Yeah. I'm up. Fuck <laughs> okay, it now. Thanks. Turn my one shot. You yeah, was foolish. Engaging. You and me both, mate. Uh. <clears throat> Thank you. It's my turn. Heal our wounds. Suffer all rain. Thank you. I'm up. <laughs> my turn. My turn. I shall go. Charging. Let's go. It's down. I'll help. <coughs> I'll care for you. Thanks. You know what? That's fine. I shall go. Targets eliminated. Move out. Um, yeah, yeah. What an adorable treasure chest! Ooh. I think that's a level three one note. It is indeed. Ah, <sighs> that hits the spot. <laughs> Let's get him. My turn. Here to play. Engaging. So much point. Beginning retreat. Exiting the field. I don't think there's any point actually. It's just going to be too painful to bother with. It's not going to get us hardly any XP there, so. Uh, charge complete. Uh. Shit. Let's rest first. So not worth it right now. I'll try it without. I apologize for the wait, Your Excellency. 
Excuse me. You're exactly on time. Just turn midday. It couldn't be. Father? So he's... He is both House Vander and its School of Swordsmanship's head, Matthias Vander, the Thunder God. He and Viscount Arsade are known as the strongest swordsmen in Erebonia. Yeah, sure, but why is he here? I get the impression he was waiting for us. It's good to see you, Your Excellency. What does bring you here, Father? Raise your weapons. Uh, sorry? I sense no threats in the vicinity. <sighs> What's going on? Prove your strength to me. If you cannot defeat me by 3 p.m., you will be disqualified. Disqualified? From what? Get ready for battle, everyone. I'm as confused as the rest of you. We're sitting ducks if we don't fight back. I'll take lead, Instructor. And where do you stand, Major? In obvious, she's been on in on this in the start. Correct. I apologize for deceiving you. You gotta be kidding me. We're up against the Thunder God and the Icy Maiden. The odds are not in our favor. For what it's worth, I promise not to hold back. I did warn you earlier that the slightest mistake me here may cost you your life. What's she doing? Is that some kind of trap? Silly bunny, get out of here now. Just get what you still can. No. I don't just get be caught so we could escape. Ash music. Pay attention. Instructor Kurt. The only ones left to fight. Appears to be an old mind powered by several control devices. Operated remotely and intended to restrain. When did you set all of this up? When I came to survey the area before <coughs> getting in the hot springs, I was hoping to immobilize all four of you at once. Unfortunately, the two of them noticed the traps arranged early enough to save you. This isn't like you at all, it's so... Are you searching for the word cowardly? In real combat, you can't assume your opponents will always follow a code of honor, you know that. Besides, my greatest strength is catching foes off guard, and I told you, I wouldn't be holding back. Because you recognize our strength, right? I would be honored by the compliment if you didn't have your gun trained on us. Still, was able to remove your greatest tactical mind from the battle, as well as the ever unpredictable Ash. I'm sure you realize this is the, one of the worst situations you can find yourself in. I mean, in Kurt stand no chance of victory against Thunder God without reinforcements either. In short, this is checkmate for you. Don't count us out yet. Precisely. This is hardly the first time we've been faced with impossible odds. I don't know what's gotten into you or Kurt's dad. If you think Class 7 can go up so easily, you're in for a rude awakening. We'll overcome this trial just like we have all the others. Very well. Show me what you can do. I will show you no mercy. <laughs> okay. What's she got? We don't know. My turn. Charging. Nuh -uh. <gasps> I'll save you. <sighs> Thanks. It's my turn. <gasps> Get him. I'll assist. <sighs> my turn. Hmm. Charging. Don't give up! 
Thank you. Yeah. Here I go. <clears throat> My turn. Charging. Thank you. I'll support. <laughs> Oops. Thanks. That's what I went to do. Pumped up. Take My turn. Arcus activate. So we're gonna get frozen when we fight. We're good. Let's get you know, to heal or so. I shall go. Arcus activate. Yeah. I'll support you. <laughs> Thanks. Uh. Oh, fuck's sake, Claire. <laughs> it's my turn. <laughs> I shall go. Charging. <laughs> I'll show you the true strength of ice. My turn. Get him. I'll assist. Engaging. Charging. Yeah. Time to bring out the big guns. Charging good and. Hopefully this will take over the end. Oh, it might just. Divide to conquer. Transform. Buff six. Sync complete. Initiating brave mode. Accelerate. Strike. Now. Ugh. Two of us cannot defeat her head on. Let's get some distance between her and us for now. Yeah, your odds of defeating me aren't low, they're non existent. As long as you have the slightest chance of victory, miracles can happen. That's how you and your class have made it this far. Once the chance is completely snuffed out, no amount of struggling can change the ultimate outcome. Your defeat is assured. It's time to end this. This isn't going well. Where are we, Instructor? The Isengard range. This is where I did the training I was telling you about earlier. Their goal was to clearly split us up, and unfortunately they succeeded. Father, what a poor show this is. You'll have to do better if you ever hope to defeat me. What are you trying to achieve here? What do we have to fight? Because we must. Are you no further explanation? Or are you such a poor warrior that you cannot swing a blow without cause to lessen its heft? Save your words, instructor. There's no getting through to enemies like this. Fine. Then we'll do this in a language he will understand. Right. At last. No more questions. <clears throat> Show me your strength. I feel like this won't go well at all, but. It's my turn. 
This is going to be a struggle, man. Let's go. Here we go. I'm up. It's my turn. Not today. Let's go. Thanks. It's my turn. Crimson Flash. Let's go. Let's get the crest back on. Not today. It's my turn. Hold out. Black Tortoise. I'm up. My turn. It's my turn. Crimson Flash. Not today. My turn. I'm up. My turn. Uh -oh. oh, shit. Oh, God. Oh, we're being paralyzed. It's oh god. Uh, okay, we're fine, we're fine. Um, I need to... I can't do anything. Uh... My turn. Arcus, activate. I'm up. Hold out! Black Tortoise! It's my turn! <laughs> Thanks. My turn! Here we go! Got him! Got him. Let's go! Oh, is it gonna be enough? I'm gonna risk it. Fierce as fire! Blazing Sword! I'm up. <clears throat> Eternally flowing. Form is emptiness. Emptiness is form. First. Second. Third. Fourth. Fifth. Sixth. Oh, that's okay, over. Right? Nice. Is that how it's going to be? Yes. It is. Bitch. Hey. He did it.
Is that all? Yeah. No. I can fight. Turn. I'm ready. Pathetic. Yeah. He's not so weak as to be killed by such an insignificant fall. He will, at most, be confined to a hospital bed for a few months. He's your son! Why would you do that to him? There is no place for restraint in Vander School duels. He is merely paying the price for his lack of skill. Being cruel to be kind requires some degree of kindness first, Your Excellency. Even if he does emerge unscathed, you won't make it back here before three. Kurt is, to be blunt, disqualified. You are the only one left to face me, Reen Schwarza. Do not disappoint me. Oh boy. This doesn't make any sense. At this rate... Come on! We'll hide under the bridge! We need to get to Instructor Reen ASAP if we're going to figure out some way to help out Ash and Musei! I agree. We need to get out of this icy water before it saps any more of our strength. That should be our top priority. I hope you don't think I can't see you down there. What's that on the hill? You see that down there? No one escapes the Icy Maiden when she's this serious, I fear. Damn it, my limbs are still numb. There has to be a way out of this trap. Hurry up and find it, girl genius. Consider countless possibilities already, but none of them will work for certain. Uh, fat lot of good you are. I'm not the only one who could have prevented this situation, you know. Could have used those animal instincts here to see this coming. You think I am, Scarecrow? I can't do any of that crazy stuff. Huh, so we're keeping you around for your wonderful personality then. Well, shut up. I cannot believe I'm stuck here when my darling instructor needs me to sign. This is unbearable. I'm worried that Altina and Yuna would be able to handle Major Claire without us too. Uh, it's some real bullshit. Um, Ash? What? Did I just see you move? I mean, I'm numb from the waist down, but I can move the rest of it. That's incredible. It's all I can do to speak. <laughs> I just trained more than you have. While you were busy plotting in the shadows and looking down on everyone, I was hitting the gym. Maybe try getting your own hands dirty for a change. I'd rather not live my life by your rules, thank you very much. But I must admit, you might have a point. <laughs> not like you to admit you're wrong. Guess then that means you thought of a plan. I certainly did. Just super clear, I've got maybe half a moment or normal movement in me at best. That's plenty. So I think you got something that might actually work then. I'm in. I'll tell you what, when and where to attack. All I require of you is to do it. First I need some silence. I need to calculate the best point to attack. I hope you don't think I can't see you down there. Is anywhere safe from her? No one escapes the icy maiden when she's this serious, I fear. She's got us surrounded. Here's where I have options. I'm glad you understand. Now if you... Now! Eat this! Impossible! What on... That was Muse and Ash. Now's our chance! You know what to do, Allie. I'll back you up. Understood. Activating Arcadius mode. You're not getting away. You're still the same Claire we know and love after all. We'd have never pulled this off if you had used a nastier trap. Activating sonar mode. I'm detecting orbital mind control units. Three in total within the vicinity.
you both all right? I'm still a little numb, but I can fight. We should go make sure you... I got it covered. Well, Billy, grab on! I'm on my way. I'm ready, Ash. Better hold on for dear life. <laughs> What else can I do except say that you got me? All right. Now we just gotta beat up that scary old guy by three, right? Which means we can't afford to stay here a moment longer. I'll go on ahead. We've got a lot of questions to ask you when we get back, Claire. Huh. What an impeccable show of teamwork. They've got little under an hour left. I just hope they make it in time. What the fuck is going on, though? Your spirit is admirable. You wield your blade well. However, your inexperience is as evident as the nose on your face. Aurelia clearly overestimated you. Did she say something about me? That you may one day surpass even her as a swordsman. It's an honor to hear she thinks that. And I'm not sure I can live up to the vision she has of me in her head. Still, if she's placing that much faith in me, I can't squander it by falling short here. Then show me you can withstand my full strength. fledgling divine blade of the eight leaves school but your first steps within the realm of greater warriors are as shaken as they are unyielding your potential is undeniable even if you have yet to realize it yourself i'm not done yet then allow me to finish this altina are you all right, Instructor? I am now. Thanks. Instructor! Still alive and kicking, huh? I'm so jealous of Altina for getting the best part. Oh, if only I could fly. You're all right. So you defeated Major Revels. I must admit, I am impressed. Instructor, where's Kurt? I don't see him. Hey. Fell from the cliff. Huh? What? Please tell me you're joking. You pull on her leg? That's a hell of a drop! I hope he's alright. Forget about hope! We gotta go save him! He might be hurt, but we have no reason to believe that his life's in danger. Right now, we need to focus on the fight at hand. That's what he'd want us to do. I mean, you're right, but... Now that you've been able to regroup, you may actually be able to defeat me if you fight at one. The clock is about to strike three. I cannot imagine you can achieve victory in time. The odds are clearly not in our favor. Sure, but screw this old man for telling us what we can <coughs> and can't do. How unfortunate. Don't count us out yet. That sounds like... Kurt! You're all right. When did you... Now that's how you make an entrance. It's quite a feat to climb directly up the cliff. If I had followed the meandering path up the mountain, I never would have made it here in time. Climbing up was my only option. Kurt, your hands! I is that blood? You can't hold your swords like that. We'll take care of the rest, so just... I appreciate your concern, you know, but I'll be fine. I wish I'd had more climbing experience under my belt, but I guess I now know it's something I need to work on. Please don't worry about me, instructor. I won't let my injuries slow me down. I have the rare chance to fight my father with all of you at my side. I would endure any pain to take advantage of it. Oh, Kurt. <laughs> Damn, someone's fired up. Then far be it from us to disappoint him. Hmm. Very well. Show me what you're capable of. 
When you work as one, on my strength as the Thunder God, I will be the one to judge your potential. Oh boy. We need no talk. Now come! Ew. <laughs> I've only just begun. Okay. My turn. Let's go. All for one and, and one for all. At once. <laughs> it's my turn. Oh, we need to ID him. Spirit unification? Yeah. Uh, spirit unification! Holy shit. I'm here. Let's go. Sure. Yeah. Too slow. Let's go. Sorry, Kurt, but it needs to be done. Sure. You're mine. <clears throat> Let's go. <clears throat> Is that all? No. I'm here. Oh, the son of a bitch got his shit back. Let's go. Hmm. 
This'll be fun. You're mine! It's my turn. <laughs> Leave it to you. Switching in. Activate. Fragora. Destroy. I'm up. Roar. Huh? Here, like strike. Very well. My turn. All for one and, and one for all at once. Uh, 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 to comfort. Will this be enough, though? No, I don't think it's going to be enough. Time to paint this town red. This is a new one. Yeah. Gotcha. And Kurt's one will be new if we get to see it. New. <laughs> Not a bad trick, huh? Eat this! It's the last call. Sinners, bubble ring! Oh no, it will be enough. Kirk. Kirk's got it. My sword and soul are as one. Light. Hurt my foes. See now. Hell yeah. Was that all? Nice. Nice. That'll I've only just begun. Ragnar Strike Two, okay. <laughs> nice. I only get cuter as I level up. Mm. Yeah, I did it. Stats updated. Now's our chance. Strike. Right. right. Huh? You're mine. You pass. We, we did? Oh, Kurt, your dad is too damn strong. Him being head of the Vander School isn't just for show. For real? You sure he's not the strongest on the continent? But I'm glad we passed. Whatever this was, even if it did take all of us. We've all grown so much. I see the battle's over. Are you watching us, Major? I only saw the fight's conclusion, I'm afraid. Your team during the battle was exceptional. You have all proven your worth. You have the strength to aid His Highness the Prince. To what? Um, I'm not sure I understand. Father? I assume he's returned to your mirror. We can tell you more there. No, I suppose I've kept you in the dark for long enough. I'll fill you in on some of the details now. Then we can tell you the rest back in your mirror. Thank you. We'd appreciate that. As I'm sure you've already deduced, defeating us was meant to serve as a trial of sorts. Hello, 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 hello. 
Hello, 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 hello to you too, mate. Long time no see. You alright? Test your strength and capabilities. Also. Yeah, the time limit screamed test to me. Glad we were able to pass it. Even if it was too close for comfort. Why test this in the first place? Glad you're doing well, mate. Yeah, good, thanks. I'm Gucci, as they say. Oh, yeah, yeah. Can't imagine even Principal Aurelia would go this far from an academic exam, which would mean. Sharp as ever, Reen. As a matter of fact. You're busy, really busy? Now you're not. Yeah. Oh, interesting. That's uni, though, I suppose, isn't it? Unless you're out of uni now, I don't remember it. This feels like. Are you alright? Something up? What was that? Couldn't be. That was a very eerie roar. Came from further along the path. Should we go and investigate, Instructor? Yeah, I don't think there's a moment to waste. Very eerie music as well. What was that? I've heard that roar before, two years ago. Oh, Adios, why now? I don't know. Everyone else oh, okay, fair enough. I'm worried about reading his students, but I need to remember that they have the major with them. I'm sure they'll be fine. We need to focus on getting our people to safety. You're right. All we can do is believe in them. But it all came jam, Mike. That roar came from over there. Schwarzer, you thinking what I'm thinking? I'm sure I am. It shouldn't be possible at this point, but it's the only thing that comes to mind. We should investigate with caution. Charge complete. What kind of game are you making? And why is it uh, Habo Hotel 2? Oh, that enemy looks like a handful. <laughs> this one's strong. Be careful. <laughs> yeah. Let's go. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, right, okay. Sounds cool, whatever it is. It's my turn. Very cool. Very good, as they say, isn't it? Haha. <laughs> Holiday. I shall go. Charging. I didn't mean to attack that one. You're going to eggs! Okay. Well, that sounds fun, mate. Come on, mate. It will be. Why wouldn't it be, eh? I think you could have stopped after scary people, mate, to be honest. My turn. I get you. The wow wow goo goo baby. Here to play. Let's go. That was the Vander style in raw form. Yeah, this is the one that came out like a couple of weeks ago. Or well, well. Came out 
in the Western region a couple of weeks ago. I think there are many more Trails games that are already out in Japan. Um, but yeah, it's, it's really good so far. Enjoying it. I'm, I'm guessing. I never looked it up in case I was, like, spoiled by cover art or something. Um, I could be wrong. I'm only assuming. Only because the walkthrough guidey thing that I use, um, it said that it was a poor... It, some sections could not make sense because it's a Japanese translation. So... And for a walkthrough to be out when the game's only been out like a week or two, you know, makes me think that this game's been out for ages. But I don't know. Maybe, uh, maybe the Western is up to date. But I wouldn't know. I don't know anything. Where am I? Savvy Sunga. This one is certainly worth holding on to. Three years ago in Japan. Ah, there you go then. Huh. You have the advantage. I paid to the ass. You hold me for a hobble. Time? What time? Attack. Too slow. Oh, maybe it's just my side then. It went like a. It's my turn. My turn. Yeah, but like a. I'll support you. Thank you. There's more. Yeah, she is. How did it's you know that? Kane, Dale! Engaging. <laughs> yeah, I say. Very well. It's my turn. Uh. Ah. That's the power. That's the power of my PP. Rare item inventoried. Yay. <laughs> yes. Scott, whoa. Steady, mate. <laughs> We're at an advantage. It's my turn. Oh, you can't move. None of you can move. No, leaving so soon. It's 
Got him. Don't be afraid to give me a real thorough review, instructor. <laughs> Innuendos aside, from where I'm standing, you get full marks in combat. Okay. Yeah, and then putting him in a purple snow globe. <laughs> that, oh, okay, that was fine with you. The purple snow globe with the pentagram in it, that was alright. Really resonated with you, that one. <laughs> Oh, that was so soothing. Fair enough. Strong enemy sighted. Let's take it out. Be strong. Be careful. I'm up. I shall go. Just joking, I'm not in trouble, huh? My turn. It's fine. Arcus activate. Wondrous vomit. That's what I would describe it's vomit as as well. <laughs> they, yeah, they they found out the incest, that's what uh they're after me. These nuts. Engaging. Charging. Eternally flowing. Form is emptiness. Emptiness is form. First. Second. Third. Fourth. Fifth. Sixth. Seventh. Uh, yeah. Hello. Very well. Yeah. My turn. Uh. Arcus activate. I shall go. It's my turn. Very well. Hmm. 
let's use uh, let's use this. Hmm. Here to play. What did I do too? I'll care for you. Thanks. I shall go. Two damage, not attacks. Battle complete. Let's continue. There's a treasure chest right over there. <laughs> Sorry. Charge complete. Oh, you know me, mate. That's all I do say. All I say is wise words. That's all I'm capable of saying. Like, even if I went out of my way to purposefully say something not wise, it would end up being wise. You wise me? <laughs> True. True. You always knew just what to say, Scott. We had an advantage. Yeah, you can never spot. Yeah, you're right. You're right. Let's go. Kane down. Go flat. Let's go. Let's electrocute everyone. Oh, more guests? Very well. I don't think they consider you know what? Doesn't matter. Uh, it's my turn. Engaging. I am engaged. Charging. I'm here. Hello. I'm Chris. Arcus, Go. On. <laughs> Not today. Today. Thank you. I'm up. Why did I say I said thank you with a question mark, and then I was just gonna say thank you again. Thank you. Thank you. That flying Engaging. ahead. Uh, I'm here. Go shoot that flying ahead. Oh. oh. It's my turn. Ha! All right. Nice work, team. Meow, meow, meow. Hello, me. They're in 
Disarray these nuts. That was an interesting sound. Here to play. My turn. Arcus activate. Got a fucking <laughs> column of spells. I'll support you. Thank you. Where? I'm up. Come on. It wasn't just me that thought she said go. I it? shall go. I'll support you. Thank you. That was the Vander style in raw form. Yeah, go. But she said go. Without T in it and the O. Check it out, free stuff. Curia, you are a. Let's see it again. And save. Yeah, it's good. I'm not a go. Oh. Okay. What? A magic knife. Just being near it sends chills down my spine. Looks to be one of the more powerful knights. It's about to look like it's had its ass kicked. The knight we once fought in the Glacier Shrine. Damn, he's got some, like... He's got some... What's it called? Sass in his step. Be careful, everyone. It's no one in your foe. Don't worry, as long as you all stay alert, I know we can take it. Let's do this. This one's strong. Be careful. Down or blue? Wow. It's my turn. That's a bit of shit, isn't it? Guard. Anything else? My turn. It's my turn. Did we just reflect and analyze back at ourselves and it didn't work because he reflected it? Huh. Fuck's sake. Very well. Uh well he still reflects everything in the world, so let's just attack. Let's go. <laughs> Take a long hard look at yourself. That's what he said. Let, take a long, hard Shuriyama at yourself. Here to play. All right, try again then. Not on my watch. Go. 
Oh, one more time. I shall go. Hey, Bass, you all right, mate? this really box I was foolish I'm here My turn. Arcus activate. Let's go. Arcus activate. Use Marcus. I'm here. Anyway. Arcus activate. Yeah. My turn. Oh fuck. I fucked up. Um, how much CP do I need? 40? Um, Listen, Evan Crystal. My turn. Evon, Evon Crystal. Lebron's crystal. Lol. Thanks. All for one and one for all. He's not. Oh no. I got assist. Uh, attack. Too slow. It's my turn. Uh, 
probably just raging fire. Raging formation. Fierce fire. Blazing swords. I'm here. It's time. Now. Transform. I've got a chilling spell for you. Well, isn't that a pretty sight? <laughs> Raging alcoholic. <laughs> Damage dealt plus twenty-five percent to liver. Oh my goodness, did that hurt? Let's go. He's got the power. We need defense. Ow. Er. Is this really worth it? I feel like no. Marcus, activate! Who's Marcus, man? My turn. Uh, huh. Thanks. I love you. Let's go. What did sh somebody love someone? Is that what I heard? Uh oh. Oh no. Alright, let's get one of these on. Listen, Ivan Crystal. My turn. I guess activate. Imagine me in that ship. It's my turn. Uh anyway. <laughs> Freeze no. Mute. Yes. Is it worth it? Uh. Okay. My turn. Oh no! As that kid once said, I'm in danger! <laughs> So it's probably best to just do this. He is a real kid. He's real. He's my paralysis demon. <laughs> That's the power of the 
eight weeks. Nice. I've only just begun. That's all right. Get cuter. The stats updated. I appreciate yeah, that though. Uh, Scott. <laughs> nice. Runway Smash Three. <laughs> Morgan's May Three. See ya. Target neutralized. Good work, everyone. Not to belittle our stunning accomplishment, but that felt like a walk in the park after facing down the Thunder God. For real. But anything would look bad next to that. I'd prefer it if you didn't talk about my father like he's some kind of monster. Though having just been tossed down the side of a mountain, I suppose I can see where you're coming from. Still, what was a magic golem from the Dark Ages doing here? <laughs> That's a good question. Although I do recall hearing that one appear during here during the Civil War. I mean, that's true, but they're only supposed to appear when the spirit veins are simulated, as they were during the Civil War and the Great Twilight. Exactly. I'd have to ask Emma or Rosetta to be sure, but I'm not sensing the same kind of disarray in the veins that I did then. Then there's the fact that the Black Records describe the Magic Knights as having been created to compete with the Divine Knights, but every last Divine Knight is gone, so why would they appear now? That is rather perplexing. That's not the only mystery either. I'm just concerned by that power it used. I was under the impression that it was only possible to affect causality by using the Great Twilight. Yeah, I remember you, Lecter, and Cedric using it back then. Probably not a good sign that a Magic Knight can use it too. There's another one? More than one, it appears. They came from the Valley Path. We should hurry. Your mirror may be in danger. Right, let's get moving. Uh oh. Never mind. The fucking badass guy just killed all of them on his own. Whoa. He defeated all of them by himself. We weren't needed here after all. Damn, he didn't even break a sweat. Better thought we've only seen a faction of what he's capable of. Regardless, Ymir should be free of danger now. It's a relief. Is everyone ready to head back to the mansion then? <laughs> Thank you again for saving my village, Lord Mateus. Think nothing of it. A light workout now and again, just the body good. A light workout, he says. I'm not sure we can even imagine how someone of his strength sees the world. Well, I think it's time we got down to business. Then my wife and I will leave you to it. No, please. You two have long been close to the Imperial family. I think it would be best if you remained. Oh. Does this involve them somehow? Come to think of it, you mentioned aiding His Highness the Prince earlier. The truth is that several days ago, Prince Oliver and Lady Sherizard left for their honeymoon aboard the Courageous Two. They have not been seen since. How could they be missing? Lady Charizard! And you're certain of this? I'm afraid so. We haven't been able to reach the ship or any of its crew. You've lost contact with the entire ship? They were only just starting their new lives together. You don't think it could have malfunctioned and crashed, do you? Unlikely. It's one of the most advanced airships in the land. I agree. They've always kept it well maintained, too. I think we can discount that possibility. Which means there must be a human culprit behind this. Anyone put out a statement yet? You know, like, if you want to see your beloved prince again, you better pay up, or anything like that. Though we, too, are operating under the belief that this was a deliberate crime. To date, no one has claimed responsibility for it. No leads there, now. This whole situation seems really unnatural. Are we sure the prince isn't deliberately trying to conceal his whereabouts? It wouldn't be the first time. 
I doubt it. He's got no reason to pretend to be dead like he did during the Great Twilight. And at this point in his life, he isn't the type to worry others without very good reason. Regardless of the reasons for his disappearance, this is a crisis of national import. Hence, Emperor Eugen entrusted me with the task of investigating it in secret. So His Majesty doesn't want anyone to know? That makes sense. If the general population was to find out, it would almost certainly spark a panic. And the unfortunate timing would only serve to throw fuel on the fire. As a precaution, we've only informed these who, uh, those who need to know. It's a good call. Last thing we need is more chaos with the signing ceremony and crossbow coming up. I don't think this is done by someone who didn't want Crossbow to gain its independence to you. If it were, they most likely would have issued a statement by now. We can't rule out that possibility, but we don't have enough evidence to seriously consider it either. I've mobilised the students of the Vander School to help in the search, but we need more people on the ground. Which led me to asking for Class 7's assistance. He came to me as a graduate of Thoris, and I agreed to offer him my aid. I spoke to Principal Le Guin to secure her approval, and then summoned those of you here as Class 7's representatives. The mirror was chosen so that we may, might discuss the situation and search at the same time. So far, that search has not borne fruit, but the appearance of magic knights is concerning. Agreed. It's too odd to be just a coincidence. On another note, this trial gave me an opportunity to see how capable you all are. Um, I thought you went. To, I thought you went to bed. Just fell asleep. I came away very impressed. Ah, uh -huh. that's a relief. I'm glad we didn't disappoint. As if we would. And Kurt, I'm especially impressed with the capable young man you've become. Thank you, Father. That said, I must hear your answer. And on that note, are you willing to assist in the search for Prince Oliver and Lady Sherazade? Erebolian needs Prince Oliver, and he has done more for Class 7 than we can ever repay him for. I don't know who or what is responsible for his disappearance, but none of us can turn a blind eye to it. We will devote all we have to finding and, if necessary, rescuing him. I'm sure all of the others who couldn't join us would say the same thing. Excellent. Then consider yourselves entrusted with this task. We'll be counting on you. Right. Now, the matter being confidential does mean we cannot officially mobilize the army to aid in the search. If there's anyone you trust to bring in for additional help, however, you have full permission to share this information. Understood. Though our assistance may be minuscule in comparison, we will do whatever we can. The Isengard range is our backyard, so we could mount a thorough search of it and the surrounding area. Your help is much appreciated. Lord Schwarzer. Lord Schwarzer. <laughs> Having accepted Matthias Vander's request, Class 7 is formally added to the search for Prince Oliver. By the time their conversation reached its end, however, the day had drawn to a close, prompting a decision to remain in your mirror for the night. Oh boy. What's going on here? Breathing twice in one day feels a little indulgent, but I can't have any lingering fatigue holding me back. I'm going to need my contact. Uh, I'm going to need to contact my old classmates to discuss how to approach the search as soon as possible. But boy, what a day! I'm honoured to have had the chance to face the Thunder God one on one. I just wish I could have put up more of a fight. I may be a divine blade now, but I still have a long way to go to truly feel worthy of that title. You don't like his chest tattoo? Still, that's not the most pressing issue right now. Let me wait till it goes back to... Unless I miss something, I can explain. I'm more concerned about why those magic knights appeared. And what that strange feeling was. Oh, that. <laughs> so basically, the story of this guy is that... Um, as a child, he was impaled with like a, a stake from an explosion. And, like the house blew up and like a stake came and impaled him. You... Are... Um, and so his, he has his father's heart in his own. Do not lose sight of yourself. So that's why he's got the scar. That sounds like 
Swords are without form and exist within oneself. If you have need of your blade, you need only to grasp it in your mind. Grasp it in my mind. No, no, he's got one heart. So he had a heart as a child. There was an explosion. A piece of wood impaled him. And then his dad was like, fuck no! It made a deal with the devil, basically. And then he lost his heart, put it in his son. Which is this guy. So it really was you. Something seemed amiss. But my advice may help. Thank you. It really did. This silence is so intimidating. I hope I haven't disappointed him by letting him see me like that. They're gonna kiss. Green Schwarza. Sir, I am very grateful to you. <laughs> For what? He's looking in the reflection right now. Look at him. He's giving the side eye like. For all you have done for Kurt. Oh. The hot springs won't do you any good by standing. Sit. I was going to say, this is really awkward. Why are you just standing? I, I suppose you're right. I've long been aware of my son's burdens. His worry stemming from House Vander being stripped of its long-held duty to protect the Imperial family and of concern for Prince Cedric. Yet as a father, I chose not to console him. I do not regret that decision. But I am relieved that he found you to help him break free of his shell. He's grown more than I ever could have imagined. That is why I am grateful. So you were still thinking of him in your own way. Truthfully, I don't think I deserve the credit you're giving me. Kurt's development came from his own ceaseless hard work and the support of the friends he met along the way. All of that was only possible because of your guiding hand. <laughs> I certainly tried to play a part, but I still think my role was minor. Shut the fuck up and take the compliment, you little bitch. <laughs> I'd like to ask, why were you withholding your strength during our duel? Was I? Even I would struggle against the Divine Blade of the Eight Leaves School fighting at their best. I think you're overestimating me as much as Countess Liquin did. I played more of a supporting role after my students arrived, but I wasn't shying away either, I assure you. I'm simply not capable enough to do that against an opponent of your caliber. Then that leaves only one other possibility. Something weighs heavily upon you. Then you could tell. It came through loud and clear as we crossed blades. I suppose strength like yours wouldn't come without being so perceptive as well. Does this worry relate to the state I found you in earlier? I'm honestly not sure myself. I see. No situation is too complex for the warrior who follows a simple course. We use our skill to protect that which we cherish. We need not strength for anything more. <sighs> I'm ashamed to have almost forgotten something so fundamentally important. Thank you for reminding me of that, Your Excellency. I spent longer in there than I planned to, but thanks to the pep talk, I feel a lot better now. I don't want to stay out too long and be late for the meeting back home. But that's not until later, so I think I'll walk around a bit and cool off. Towels! Right, put everyone in a towel. No, I'm joking. <laughs> Quick save. I need to do this. Fucking high speed mode because otherwise we're just gonna sit through a fucking What's it called? The panorama zoom camera thing?
There's Kurt on the lookout platform again. I think I'll see how he's doing before heading home. Can you see where you fell off the cliff? This view is just as beautiful in the evening as it is in the day. Yeah, on a clear night you can see a whole sea of stars up there. Thank you for supporting me today, Instructor. I feel much more confident in my own abilities after the battle earlier. Glad to hear it. But you still look like something's bothering you. I know Prince Oliver's disappearance is weighing on you, sure. But I feel like there's something else on your mind. You really can see right through me, can't you? After training under you for so long, I was finally able to show my father how much I've improved. Between that and the fact we Vanders are once more able to serve as guardians of the Imperial family, I should be happy. But the man I swore to protect is no longer within my reach. So that's what's bothering you. The rumours of him becoming an Ouroboros enforcer are certainly concerning, without a doubt. And if they are indeed true, I cannot say I don't understand what drove him to it. All his life, he's been denied the freedom to choose his own destiny. He was treated as an object, sheltered as a youth, then used and tormented as he grew into a man, all because of his royal blood. So when he was given the chance to live a life of his own choosing for the first time, he took it. I can empathise. It does make a certain kind of sense. Of course, that empathy does not mean that I've given up on bringing it back. I think I made that perfectly clear to him when we last spoke. I told him that we need to start seeing each other as we are. I don't know when I'll have the chance, but one day I will go and find him. I don't know where we'll take it once I do. To the bedroom. But if nothing else, I want him to know how I feel. Uh, did I say something strange? Not at all. I thought I was going to need to give you some encouragement, but you picked yourself right back up. Just like you did when you were knocked off that cliff earlier. Still haven't quite well, quite wrapped my brain around that one. I was just acting out of desperation, that's all. My father really does think too highly of me. You and you and the others would have grown up fine, just even without me. I'm inclined to disagree, Instructor. Wait, did you have a chance to talk to him? A little. We ran into one another in the springs and he gave me some excellent advice. Maybe a man a few words, but he possessed a tremendous kindness. I was honestly kind of intimidated by him at first, but now I can see the caring heart under that scary exterior. should have known it wouldn't take you long to see him for who he really is. Outside of combat or training, he's a giant kindly... General Hope! He doesn't smile much, and he has never been one to speak his feelings, so he's very easily misunderstood. He once learned that the local children were scared of him, and spent the entire day upset that he could have caused them any distress. As absurd as that sounds, it also makes perfect sense. You really do respect him, though, huh? Of course. He's the pride of my whole family, myself included. Glad to hear it. I'm going to head off. Instead of while into the meeting, we're trying not to stay out in the cold too long, right? I'll be sure to stay warm. See you later. What do you see these nuts? Whoa! Sorry. No, I'm not. Fuck him. Hello. <laughs> Sounds like she's deep in conversation about something work related. Should I wait here until everyone's ready to meet? Yes. Everyone, if I could have your attention. I'm afraid I have terrible news. Crossbell's signing ceremony today was disrupted by a surprise attack. Crossbell has been reoccupied. Huh? By who? What happened? I can't believe it. You know, um, you need to go lie down. We quite understand. Ah! Oh, don't worry about me. This is all just so sudden that it took me a minute to process it. There's no way in hell I'm going to sit around sulking when there's work to be done. Well, if you're really sure. Sorry, I should have broken the news to you more gently. It was careless of me. Don't sweat it. I imagine you must have been pretty stunned when you found out too. 
Right now, I just want to know the details of what happened. For one thing, who would do this? Good question. Can you fit us all in? Of course. I appraised, uh, apprised Lord Mateus of the details earlier, but you all deserve to know. As I mentioned, the signing ceremony of Prosperous Independence at 2 p.m. today come, came under attack. The assault was the work of a military force led by Rufus Alborea. Rufus Alborea? He was arrested, right? He was, yes. But last night, the former Governor General and his subordinates escaped from Aurochs Fort where they were being held. Though their breakout certainly put us on high alert, we'd hoped to keep this information from going public and causing confusion during the ceremony. Unfortunately, it seems people had to find out in the worst possible way. So you're saying that they escaped one night, then were able to take over Crossbelt the ne very next afternoon? There's got to be more to this. Agreed. We're clearly dealing with something that's been carefully planned. What about Lloyd and the rest of the SSS? Come to think of it, they were supposed to be helping with the ceremony security. I'm afraid I haven't heard anything about the SSS so far. I'm sure they did their best to hold off the assailants, but... No. I suppose all we can do is pray that they're alright. Kidding me? No way any real harm could have come to him with Randolph there. To agree there, I'm sure the members of the SSS are all just fine. What happened after the initial attack? Rufus's military force spread out, defeating the CGF and taking control of the entire region. After which Rufus dubbed himself the Supreme Leader, and proclaimed the establishment of the United Nation of Crossbell. That sounds ominous. He took the words right out of my mouth. His new title on Proclaimed Rule make clear that he wants to rule the entirety of Crossbell once more. Well, too bad, because we're not going to let him. That's right. If it wasn't obvious, Rufus Alvarez isn't acting alone. Is acting alone, without the government of Imperial Family Support. But why do this now, of all times? Do you have any idea of what his goal could be, Major? I'm afraid not. I will be the one to bear the responsibility for His Excellency's actions. It is the best way we can go about quelling the unrest in Erebonia and solving the issue of Crossbell all at once. I can think of no better way for us Ironbloods to honor him. I don't want to think he was lying when he said all that. Putting him aside for the moment, what's the current situation in Crossbell? I'm concerned about how surrounding nations are reacting too. Currently, Rufus' black-clad soldiers are blockading all routes in and out of the region. Both Erebonia and Calvert seem content just watching how everything plays out for the present. It makes sense for the Empire to be reluctant to interfere in Crossbell's affairs after the war. The Republic's silence is a little more unexpected. Both countries suffered major losses from the, uh, the Ions and Septarian of Zero when they attacked Crossbell three years ago. I'm guessing they aren't going to forget that in a hurry. Those losses ended up leading to the Civil War here and the economic crisis in Calvert too. So Calvert is likely playing it safe for now until they know what they're dealing with. But they're not just going to sit this out forever, are they? I doubt it. It probably won't be long before they start making moves, which is unlikely to end well given that they've steadily been increasing their military strength for a while now. All communication with the region is being blocked, so I'm afraid that's all I know. I'm so sorry I can't tell you how your family is doing, Yuna. I'm sure you must be so worried about them. No, that's alright. You're expecting it. The heart of the doesn't sound like the soldiers are occupying Crossbow are going to hurt innocent civilians. I'm more worried about those who would try to resist the occupation. People like Lloyd or the rest of the SSS. Hope they're all okay. There are a lot of other people we know in Crossbow right now too. Yeah, which is also concerning. At least in Sharon are there representing the rifle company to name two. Then Toa is there representing Thor's and Marcus is there on behalf of the inspectorate. And they were all supposed to attend the signing ceremony. They're all likely targets in the event of the attack, too. <laughs> Hell, I'd be surprised if they weren't targeted. Thanks, Ash. That puts all of us at ease. <laughs> like I said, I'm sure everyone's fine. We've been through more than our fair share of trouble in the past and came out the other end one piece. That goes for the Lloyd and the SSS, too. I wouldn't be surprised if they're all working together to get the situation under control. Yeah. Yeah, I'm sure they are. All we could do is believe in them. I assumed you have finished discussing the crossbow situation. If you would, Major, I would like to discuss the other matter at hand. Father? Something else? Yes. You see, a video recording was recently delivered to the Intelligence Division. It doesn't directly concern what happened in Crossbell, but I think it is something that all of you should see. I am C. Leader of the Reborn Imperial Liberation Front. Oh boy. 
with the iron-blooded monster slain, the Empire had claimed its key to enter an era of peace. Alas, it would seem as poisonous beliefs are now being carried on by zealots, espousing nonsense of a united nation. To those who support their losing game, and to the ignorant politicians who allow these dogs to bark, I say this. We shall see you pay for your crimes. Our first target was the foolish prince and his wings. Now bow to inaction. Our next target shall be the muck and mire that gathers in the Vermilion City. Well, there we go. Somebody's finally taking responsibility for the prince snapping. By the name of C, too. Why does that ring a bell? C was an alias used by the leader of the Imperial Liberation Front, a terrorist group who opposed the late Chancellor Osborne. His true identity was revealed to be a Thor student who you all know very well. Crow Armbrust. <laughs> yeah, that checks out. Still. I know, none of this makes any sense. Crow has no reason to be using that name again. And even less reason to abduct Prince Oliver and Lady Sher Lady, Sher Lady Shiriyama. Does that mean someone else has taken his alias for their own? I think that's a safe assumption. Unfortunately, I don't have a clue as to Crow's whereabouts. Can you get in contact with him? I'm trying to be not picking up. I know we're back home to drive for a few days. We'll be on that. Nope, oh, can't get through to him. Just like I can't contact Elisa and the others. Could something have happened in Jirai? It's been a hotbed of conflict lately due to the independence movement, so that is a possibility. But there's always the chance that he was caught up in something entirely unrelated. Some entirely unrelated trouble. I have faith in Crow. Even if he did get caught up in something, he'll get himself out of it, I know it. For sure. The guy's always been a wily one. Oi! Either way, that video does tell us a few things. True. Can't be certain of this new C's identity. But I think it's safe to assume they are responsible for the prince's abduction. They also seem to be in conflict! <laughs> Ruth was our brain and his faction. Though judging by the time of the prince's abduction, you almost wonder whether they saw Crossbow's occupation coming. Hmm. And if they did, that only raises more questions. Either way, now that we got our culprits, we won't work on going after him. Indeed. And I think our best clue will be the last part of the recording. The muck and mire that gathers in the Vermilion City, huh? Fuck. First we learn the prince was abducted, and then we get that mysterious declaration. That was a lot to take in. Either way, I'm going to discuss it with all of my classmates tomorrow morning. Then we can decide how best to approach all this. Hmm? What? I know it's March, but it's still cold to be out at night, Yuna. Especially in areas that still have snow on the ground. What are you doing here, Instructor? I could sense you out here from inside my room. Given how late it is and how new you are to Ymir's weather, I couldn't help but worry. <laughs> you can't just whip out those super senses for any old thing. Maybe. But every time they prove useful in a situation like this, I'm glad I spent time honing them. What are you sitting down for, anyway? Aren't you here to make me go inside? This isn't the Academy dorm. There's no curfew here. If you want to stay up a little late, I'm not going to stop you. Wow. <laughs> you sure you should be saying stuff like that to your impressionable students? It will. <laughs> I don't think it hurts once in a while. <sighs> so you're not going to ask me anything? I'm not even sure where to start. I feel like you're the one who has to be willing to open up here. Open up? You think I'm just trying to act fine when I'm not, don't you? Yes. Not just think it. I know I'm correct. You are. You are, but... How many times has this happened now? 
over and over. Crossbell finds itself in danger, and every time I get all worked up and cause more problems for everyone. I'm just tired of being such a burden. So what choice do I have but to bottle it all up and deal with it on my own? I get what you're trying to say. But you're missing the fact that everyone wants to help you when things go south. That goes oh, for all your classmates. And me. <laughs> if it was the other way around and one of your classmates needed help, wouldn't you want to give it to them? Well, yeah. Of course I would. But I think you're the last person I want to hear that from. I get you're our instructor and all, and students aren't supposed to be the ones teaching the teacher, but... That's not why I don't turn to you. Thing is, I have the same problem you do. And I need to work on it too. But turning to your friends, or your students, for comfort and advice isn't a sign of weakness. That's what they're there for. And that doesn't change, no matter how many times you have to do it. You help each other, so you can move forward together. Move. Nope. Then, can I... Go on. Can I turn to you for comfort now? I will. Of course you can. <laughs> we fought so hard. We thought this was finally it. So, why did they go and take it away from us again? Why can't Crossbell just be free? What did we do to deserve all this? Just leave us alone! <sighs> Do you feel a bit better now? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but now the embarrassment of all that crying in front of you is really starting to set in. Anyway, don't worry about me. I'm fine now, really. No matter how many times people take our home, we'll just take it right back from them. That's what I like to hear. Well, I... Guess it is getting late. I'm gonna head back to my room. So, um, thank you for lending me your coat. I'll give it back now. I don't want you being cold either. Thanks. Good night, Yuna. Well, I'd better get to bed too. That these nuts, no. It's been a really, really long day. What? Oh, one sec. for a save. Time for a save. Question marks root. Play through what root is it? over the case who are you you're not bandits are you 
Are you going to hurt me? Enough. Do as you're told. That, that's fine. Check the contents. It's just a stuffed animal. Did we get the wrong person? That's not just a stuffed animal, silly. It's one of my special ones. Uh. <laughs> okay. You set us up. Nice job, S. There's another one. They're down to three. Let's get them down to none. Okay. Alrighty, do your best, guys. What the fuck is going on? Look at these fucking crazy ass swords. Mark. <laughs> Who's Mark? What is Mark? Right, we have to use Mark, so I don't know what it does. Who's Mark? Do we have, uh... There. <laughs> Nurse Nadia's here. It. It's me! I'm sure we can tank it. Just one's teddy bear to perform a normal body slam with an explosion. As you do. Why did he blow up? This is awkward, isn't it? I'm sorry. Is this supposed to happen? No. Okay. 
Well, they're ID now, so that makes things a bit easier. Yeah, they're not great. I could, Scott. How shall we play? Buffing. Marking a player. Ah. How shall we play? Are you ready? Ah. Got you. Ask it for it. Okay. Keep at it. Yeah. How shall we play? Need to heal Mark's player. Appreciate it. <laughs> Ready? Target locked. Exploding teddy bear. Why you? We smashed him and thrashed him. Dear God. Now we have some new quarters to look at. You couldn't have been more right about how they moved on you. Uh, I wouldn't have even noticed them if you didn't say something first. But that's what makes us the most perfect team in the whole wide world. Still, they were clearly well trained. I thought we'd be in the clear once we reached the Empire, but guess not. At least they were dumb enough to make it obvious what they were after. case yeah what do you think's inside i don't know but whatever it is it's a big deal he was pretty adamant about keeping it secret would have been easier to have the guild transport it if it was something normal yeah and as long as it's in our hands i don't want to let him down me either he's been real good to us the problem is how we're going to deliver it with nothing but some cryptic riddle to tell us where to go we'll figure it out eventually no need to stress ourselves out over it. Yes. Well, we should get moving. We might have more of those guys hot on our tail. Sure. 
but before we address the real problem on our hands. I'm tired. I don't want to walk <laughs> anymore. You can carry me, right? Pretty please. I am not doing that. You're always so mean to me. So very mean. <sighs> Stop whining and walk. And give me the case. I'll carry it. And here was your chance to be a gentleman. Someone needs to step up their game around women. Whatever you say, Nadia. What the fuck is that? An archaism. I got it. What is with this thing? I might as well be doing nothing. Looks like it's manufactured out of some special material, but that's all I got. core can't be damaged unless you first prioritize the joints. So that's how it works. Who's the snoop? Someone with suspicious written all over him. But we'll just have to trust him for now. Hentai. Guess I'll dial it up a bit. Uh, what, you, is it like to fucking tell me about marks now? Guaranteed crits, right, okay. Oh. Shall we play? Weird. So his attacks restore EP. Okay. It's me. Ready? Activate. 
Ready? Shall we play? Wee! <laughs> <Daddy>. Pain, pain, <laughs> go away. <laughs> Fuck's sake, man. Pain, pain, go away. Did it run off? Yes, so. Thanks. What you said was dead on. No thanks necessary. However... <laughs> I will be taking this. So you helped us out to nab the case? Correct. I appreciate that your valiant efforts against your pursuers saved me a great deal of time. We're gonna need that back. And if you won't give it back, we'll take it back. Hold up, S. This might be a stupid question, but bear with me. Could you tell us your name? I go by C. I am the leader of the Reborn Imperial Liberation Front. C. Is this a bit? <sighs> This is either a crazy coincidence, or fate just really likes messing with us. Have I said something unusual? So, when we were given that case, we were told to deliver it to a person who introduces themselves as C. I'd like for you to elaborate on the details of this request of yours. Can't. That's the long and short of it. Ever since last month, we've been trying to figure out just who C could be. And we've hit dead end after dead end. Did you just say last month? Yeah. You are certain of this? And OP. <laughs> you doing okay? Those mushrooms you eat on the way here start to kick in or something? <laughs> oh, I'm quite well. I simply did not expect this affair to take such an amusing turn. Never did I expect to have this much fun. Well, if you're good, then... Is it okay with you if we open the case? 
Our work isn't considered complete until we've verified its contents have been safely received. Don't worry. That one's not rigged with a bomb, I think. You think? Then again, not like we've seen what's inside for ourselves. But now we can. I've been dying to open it. Wanna give us a hint to make it fun? I haven't the faintest idea what's inside. You went through all the trouble of stealing it when you don't even know what it is? Someone's a wild card. True. I don't know its precise contents. Whatever they may be, however, they concern the unrest that plagues Crossbell and Aragonia, and I firmly believe they will lead me to the root of its cause. Well, go on then. Open it. within deliver us hope or will it deliver yet more misfortune what Finish the game. Shouldn't be watching this. Muggers. Time to know. Um, I have to start a route. Okay, I'm gonna start uh, Lloyd's route and then I'm going to, um, the first chance I get I'll save and then that'll be the end of the stream. 
Sebast, if you're if you're around, we could play some D4 or something. Our only wish was to be free. The cross belt to have true freedom. Freedom that no one would be able to take from us again. Behind that wish was one burning desire to be proud once more. We wanted to reignite the pride that everyone in this land held deep in their hearts. Picture of a hero. However, Crossbell has no need for you any longer. Now kindly get off the stage. We didn't make the choices we did to be heroes. The path we chose was so we could finally. A new, a new story, story is in motion. motion. Your fate is but one thread intermingled with many. Now, rise from your slumber. Was that all? Just a dream? Lloyd? Grisha. Oh, thank goodness. You're finally awake. How are you feeling? Are you in any kind of pain? Uh, I'm fine. But where am I? What happened to the ceremony? What about Crossbell's independence? <sighs> Crossbell City was occupied again by the Ebon Defense Force and their commander, self proclaimed supreme leader, Rufus Alborea. Scrim, innit? Together. This isn't over yet. There are still people here who haven't lost their minds. Take Lloyd and run. If anyone can turn all of this around, it'll be the SSS. <sighs> well, I'm not seeing any other options. All right, let's make a break for it. Split up and get out of the city. Understood. I'll scan for a safe route. I'll go after Kia. Risha, you take care of Lloyd. Got it. So we were forced to split up. I hope they made it out okay. What about Kia and Cecile? They came to watch the ceremony. Are they all right? I'm afraid I don't know. I've gone scouting a few times since the ceremony ended two days ago. But I haven't come across any leads about what happened to them. Or Elia and Sully, for that matter. Oh. Damn it! How could I have let this happen? Protecting Crossbell was my... was our duty. Lloyd. <laughs> Staying here isn't an option. I have to see for myself what's happening in the city. Risha, 
You come with me? Yes, of course. The boat shack is a little old place where. Whatever medicine he gave me is some really powerful stuff. I was injured pretty badly, but even the worst of my wounds have already healed. It's an ointment made from a recipe passed down for generations between those who bear Yin's name. That was the last I had, sadly. It's powerful, but not a miracle. Your wounds can still reopen, and there's nothing can do to help you regain your stamina. So try not to overdo it, alright? Got it. I really owe you one for using what you had left on me. Okay, let's get moving. Alright, let's save. Okay, that's all. That's gonna be all for me for today. I love you all, look after yourself, stay hydrated, enjoy today, have saving, and I'll see you tomorrow for more trails, woo!